underneath the rolling form. And look at this now, Cap. Heavily pushing mid and going to be able to force the buyback. I can't believe they're in this position right now. First split, disruption to be able to save him. Naga's Iron won't take that damage. They want more buybacks. They absolutely Give us do. the one you call your war, they say. Holding CT and he's in trouble. Gets speared up into the tower. Now begins they to can't let him die the here. there as well. And he dies just like that. And the Dark Rift, they force the buybacks. Got CT and CT and out there and away. As soon as you lose that fight, Naga Siren starts taking over. I will say I'm absolutely loving how they're using the Underlord ulti this game. Oh, yeah. They've done such a good job of playing around it. It was really only that one fight that was super confusing. All the moves that they've made. As right all now. their sides are being assailed right now, they've got to choose the one. BKB, the roll in from MSS, but Old Chicken commits to be able to kill Pylon dying now inside the arena against two cores, throwing out Gontribuke after Gontribuke. He's doing a lot of damage, but the nature's attendance heals, keeping staking up to full. But he's now been perched up, Soul Catcher instantly healed up to full again. Kaka running in here with the Diabolic Edict, but this three versus five may actually work for Newbie as they are repelling Keen bit by bit, and they're going to claim their first life. That's going to be Kaka, unless. No, they have the vision. The Glimmer Cape won't actually save him here. Here. Old Chicken slowed down, does Manta off the slow. He also has the Song of Sirens. So They're getting Newbie, too overzealous right now. They should not overextend themselves too much. The Song being threatened, Old Chicken thought he had an opportunity They're to get another right kill. Now, Cap. There's no Glyph available for Newbie and... MSS is gonna roll in. He's gonna do a lot of damage with this one. Looks at Yi as a little bit low. Might be able to commit for it on the side. It looks like Old Eleven's gonna get caught a little bit, but he does have the Dark Rift, and they're all gonna join him with a Song Dark Rift combo. This is a classic duo that just looks. Oh, Dark Rift out, but there is a Naga Siren Sleeve. They have to be careful about this. Yeah, now the Illusions are gonna start poking at them. The Shadow Poison's gonna come in. The Firestorm as well. This feels like too much for Nubi to really commit to Roshan, but we'll see. They're trying. You are. He's gonna pop the Satanic early to make sure he's full HP. Now he pops BKB just to make sure they can take down this Aegis. Old Eleven's gonna go inside the pit. He gets forced out the way. Hurricane Pike oh. down to sleep going out. The Aegis on the deck. MSS, MSS gets it. rolls through. He picked up every little bit of items on the ground. Kaka, he's gonna be heal up. He will be able to fight this one out, but he quickly just is gonna get almost exploded there. As Newbie are having a hard time dealing with all this. The Gods of Duke actually hitting you are inside the pit, who's very low, but Snaking is dishing out the damage. Heaven's Albert will be able to buy some time back inside the pit where you are holding strong trying to deal with the damage hoping the satanic could go off but it's not good and now it's mss inside the arena with that aegis he picked up during his rolling thunder kaka almost dying once again with glimmer cake off oh, he'll miss nothing nothing is there that's going to be able to spare him he's now forced to buy back mss another rolling thunder as he rolls on top of dark the earth splitter keeps him in place as well and they knock back ye almost finishing him up but a good god's rebuke heals him up a little bit more he jumps away away from snaking away from mss Five He's seconds for, for the now, Dark but Rift. Old Eleven, he Four. has Dark Rift. Two seconds up. Can they do the damage? Thinking he's hit so much, he's out of mana, so they can't commit. Did, did he miss the slight change? Yeah. Oh, they managed to get the sight. They know that CC and C is in here. They're going to try and take advantage of the right now, but the BKBs have been forced down. That's why Ye says, see you later. I'm out of here. Infinite dodges. Ah, uh, they do have the disruption as well. So he doesn't actually take that much damage down. The songs are going to be able to reset full heal up this Ye. Now he's going to refresh and go for another spear, but a refresher you are. Gets off the BKB. He doesn't get pinned to the wall, and he doesn't take that much damage either. So now they still hold. Uh-oh, Naga Siren. Now he's been sight. They start laying out the damage, but he does have they the mana. The rocket's they on top of him, too. Missile, but they do have the disruption. And Another save, another one. BKB going out from Old Chicken. The infinite shots are coming in. The spear MSS away. coming Body through. Hard, but MSS rolling on through. Doesn't actually hit the Naga Siren. The BKB lasted just long enough. So, and now MSS might have to back up a little bit as they do have the catch on to Pilot Die. Yi is back up here. He does have another spear, but they managed to blow up Underlord. And now Yi, he's dead as well. They have a buyback. Keen, can they hold four versus five? But look what's happening inside the base. Kaka's just going for it. But they might need his help. They're trying to buy refresh. Sure. They're gonna try and come back. CC and C is gonna be able to go for it. They have a refresher on him. The die bulk is a threat. But old chicken, he's gonna try to slow things down as much as possible. MSS, one tier four down. Kaka going for another die bulk but C and C and C's dancing away. Back over to the mid lane. MSS holding. Does have a little bit more damage. Old chicken now to half health. Another disruption. They're just focusing on the bear. But he the catches him. He does manage to get you are. Can they focus him down? They need old chicken, but he's too weak. He can't actually go for this kill. He can't join Yee. They're not doing any damn damage. Yee, they have to the best up the re he reset the sleep. He gets it off. He's going to be able to heal up the He's healing so much with a, a divine rapier. They lost a divine rapier, and now Newbie can just go for the throne. There's nothing There's no to stop them. There's no song. There's no damage. They they're can't dance around. They're just focused on the throne, and they're going to.
gonna be able to dance, 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 baby! Take down that throw B! They make the comeback! Again! The Again. second time today! That is unbelievable! That I can't believe Keen lost this game. Dude, there's no way Keen should have lost this game. Give themselves some, some more winning conditions, you know, but they have to be so careful. He's gonna buy back for sure. If he was gonna buy back, I would have done it earlier, right? Now he's gonna buy back. The charge comes out. That's on a hunt. They've got him stunned up as well. The OG coming in from the Spirit Breaker. They look over the OG. They've got him locked up with the Banshees. But Ali Abyss away comes through. Hong is gone. They'll look over at Bobby with the Cold Embrace. He stays alive for a little bit longer and might end up dead. He finally falls. 80 seconds on the sidelines. They both got five back on the OG as well. The Winter Wyvern. They look over at Hustle, who's gonna be able to get out. But the charge is coming in on the Dap BB. Gets away from Carl. Dap BB out of mana but out of the range of T1. Yep, and Prophet is not the one that died, so he's gonna keep up the speed push pressure, top lane. They will have to respond to that. He can easily stall out the game for 70 seconds. There won't be any buyback needed from the Ember, I mean, from the OD or the Winter Wyvern. Got Whitemon here, that's it. I don't know if he can be the one who saves this. Carl with the slight, trying to clean up as best he can. You see the big fears, they're so brutal. Rain has gone. Yeah. But it's really obvious they smoked up because they're not pushing out the lanes. Don't get caught here, oh my Asa god. Asa charge, that's gonna land as he ends his roll, but OD's coming in. They'll jump forward, Astro Imprisonment, that's gonna be saved, but they hit the balance strike, and now they'll look over as the Witcher's Curse is gonna be used onto the Ember's Brew. We've got the BKB off, but the OD comes out from Zephyr, as well as the Bash on the Hung. They get that coming, the OD's gonna be dead for 100 seconds. The Static Storm is around onto the Storm Spirit, as well as the Nature's Prophet, but Cuckoo, he's in deep and not gonna be able to survive if he stays in right next to the Storm Spirit. They'll get that kill onto the Timber, they'll take him out, he buys back immediately with the Remnant away from Carl. They get the kill on a Hustle, they've taken out two, and he doesn't have buyback. Dab BB as well as Red and Bombi now on the run. But look at these treants. They're pushing in. They're creeping forward. You need to be careful if you're T1 how much time you spend out of the base. The other town, which is 650 health. Mm, okay. Mm -hmm. Forward. Hitting the Rex now. And now they're hitting the racks. It's not just a passive push from the nature's prop of the roll in. That comes through from Hustle with VKB being popped by Zephyr. They're gonna charge and hit this Earth Spirit. They've got the static storm down with the kinetic field. They look over at Carlos taking a lot of right comes from Hung. VKB being popped as well as the Wukong's command coming in. They get the kill on the Hustle. He's gonna be there for 100 seconds. He'll buy back. And now, can they go for anything more? They committed the Wukong's command. That's a lot of commitment coming in from T1. But now, with another life available on the Earth Spirit, they can reset, go again, and now you don't have the tools to use in the previous engagement. Here come the Treants, here comes the Aggression, they'll look over, Remnants forward, looking over at Red with Ball Lane to go to the back lines, trying to get on top of the Disruptor. They've stunned him up, they might be able to kill him off. Daffy B pops the BKB, but White Mon gets in Viz for a second. The Abyssal Blade's used out of the Storm Spirit, can they get the kill? Timber Chain as well as the Jogram, but no, the ball inning the way from Daffy B. They've got the Glimpse back into the hands, a Cold Embrace comes out just in time with the Hex on a Zephyr. Hung, trying to fight Astro Prismate, me with the Ball Lightning comes in from Zappy B. He's trying to escape, but he's out of mana. Chakram right on top of him. He's eating the cheese. He gets away. But they look over the Winter Wyvern. Bobby's dead for 89 seconds. He's got buyback. Is he going to use it? That's the question. BKB is off by Red. He's going to TP away. Nothing's done. No, first they bash. Oh, Red. You unlucky man. You get bashed up. You get killed. And you'll leave with 120 seconds on your respawn timer. Now they found themselves hung with the charge being so fast. They've got the ghost coming out from the Spirit Break. But the BKB's been popped by Hung. Saturday's Eclipse gets dropped. With the Static Storm as well as the Kinetic Field around on the OD as well as the storm. They get a kill on the Dappy B as well as Hung. They'll take out Hustle and Bobax around the horn from the side of 496. They look over a red. Nature's pump. It's gone and dead. He just fought back. He's dead for two minutes and there's no way he's coming back into this one. The trains will come forward, but it's not going to be enough as everybody's alive for the side of T1 and three heroes with 100 second plus timers dead on 496. Eat him. He's out of mana. Some of those creeps survive. They're going to go for the tier 3 and then on to the tier 4. So they're already setting up for it. They want to finish this game. It's just the storm as well as the Winter Wyvern. You need the curse to save your life to save this series for the side of 496. They look over at Bobby. They're going to have the charge for the blink away. He gets back towards the well. They've dusted up. They thought he went invis, but that's not the case. Zephyr coming all the way through with the glimpse. Static Storm all locking up this Winter Wyvern. It's going to be enough with the OT from Zephyr. They'll get their kill. Four heroes gone. Now the tier 4s. They're rocking low. Storm needs everything to go his way. And it's not looking wisely. T1 are on the way to win the series, but there's the electric vortex that comes out of Missouri with the BKB being popped by Jackie, who also used that abyss win. No mana left on the Storm Spirit. He's getting low, trying to survive. No protection, not gonna matter. T1 take the game, they take the series, and 496 just not enough.